close their nose. Please, we want you to be our friend. That is why we are making this call. As it is now, I'm going to ask a question. Who already had a PVC? Who has made a recapturing of his PVC and has not called it? Okay, let's start from who, who has it now. PVC, can you please put your hands up? Your PVC with you. You have a PVC. Let me see your hand. Even if it's not here now, we are sure you are going to bring it. Yes. If you don't have it now, but you can bring it maybe tomorrow or just tomorrow. Okay, if you know you have a PVC, just raise your hand. I told you where the boy, where the boy. That did the boy. I'm not seeing your hand, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 17, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, 18, the rest, what is happening? Because we are ready to fight. Yes, I'm not hiding it though. Me, I'm not hiding this. I'm not, I'm not going to talk under anything. I'm going, I have to be blunt with you. I have, to, I have narrated everything for you. That in the continent, we have continent Africa. Out of that continent Africa, we have West Africa. In West Africa, we find Nigeria. In Nigeria, there is Lagos. In Lagos, there is Etiosa. Within Etiosa, we have Gara. And this is where it all Gara. And by the grace of God, for Gara today, we shall take our decision. The people that will be friends with us are the people that have their PVC, the people that will be doing business and making profit, confident profit here, will only be the people they have their PVC and are willing to hold our party, APC. Nothing short of that. If you have any other party in mind, as a Nigeria, I am not holding you. But make sure you are far away from Bara. Just give gap very well from Bara. You want to vote Labour Party? You want to vote PDP? It will not be here. That is, you see, election has been coming and going. We have never done this kind of calling before. But this one is a directive. As I am talking to you, even my being a person is at stake. The status of my children is at stake. If you people fumble, and that is why I'm not going to look at it that way, I will not allow you to jeopardize my own future and the future of my own children. So, gentlemen, I don't know what you want to do because as it is, we are here now, you have all failed. You have all failed and you are ready to battle with us. We are also ready. We are also ready. For the few, about five or ten of you that have the PVC that are voting here, we will identify you. The rest, you can no longer stay with us. I am sorry. You will do your needful. That's it. Over to you. Thank you very much. Um, I greet uh, everybody. Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, you are welcome to this uh, very important uh, meeting. The meeting is important because it has to do with the life of Nigeria and Nigerians. It has to do with the life of Nigeria and Nigerians. How our country can be better off. From what it is present. And as my brother has said, this is Bara community, Lagos State. I know many of you come from different places north, east, south, south, and the rest, even southwest, Rogo State, or your and the lives. And you are here in Lagos State. You are doing your business peacefully. Nobody is disturbing you. When you finish your business every day, go to your various locations where you reside. Sleep there, take your money there. The next day you come here, 
Nobody has been disturbing you. It is because of what? It is because the people of Bara are disturbing people. It is because Lagos State is okay. If Lagos State is not okay, many of you will not be able to come. If Lagos State is not okay, some will come and immediately they will run back to their states and say, ah, that place is a no way real. Even as we are talking, in Lagos State, there are some parts of Lagos State that you cannot even stay anyhow. Before you know a cuckoo who will lay a cuckoo, do any sort of thing. But here, people of Atheos and Bar in particular, we are this lovely. We accommodate everybody. I know many people. This Baba has been with us for a very long year. So, I know so many people that come here as child like this. Now they have built houses in Lagos State. They have built houses in their country, in their, in their, in their states, and every other place. They are doing business. It is because Lagos State is okay. Look at him, look at Simba, look at so many other people. But we do not disturb you. We have been accommodating, we have been playful, we have been friends with you all the time. But this time around, as you have been benefiting from us, we, want to, we also want to benefit from you. This time around. And that's the only thing that can cause problem between yourself and us. Because as he has said, we have been mandated to talk to you. If we have not called you to talk to you, you say, I oh, have oh, they did not call us. I didn't mean they have called us, and uh, we have done what they wanted us to do. And that is why we are calling you. We are begging you now. We are appealing to you. We are seeking your conscience that for Lagos State to continue to be peaceful, for HSR to continue to be peaceful, for people, all of you in Baya, to continue to live peacefully and be doing your business, and for Nigeria as a whole. Because let us look at it. Since 1999, when we have, when people are talking that it is Abia, uh, it is uh, Tinubu that remodeled Lagos, some, some other people are saying trash. We know how Lagos was before 1999. Many of you that have been to Ajegule, many of you that have been to Bariga, you know how all those places are. They are slums. Many that have been in Mushi, those places are slums. Many that have been in Ladipo, Ladipo is living in a noble area. There. But look at all those places today. It is because somebody has done the groundwork for the girls to continue to exist and progress all the time, daily and daily. And that's why many people are coming. I can say that before anybody in Nigeria thinks of going abroad, the first thing of coming to Lagos, is that also? They will first think of coming to Lagos. When they are able to make some living and not money, they will not say, yes, at least I have tried. Let me go to the US. Let me go to London. Let me go to so many other places. It is because the people of Lagos State are accommodating. The government of Lagos State are doing what is right. I don't want to talk about other states. What I want to tell you, and I know, as he has said, that those of you that have skin disease, some I know, many of you have it, and you don't want to tell us that you have it. What you are going to do, what you are going to do, because I know that some of you may not be voting here, but you'll be voting in different other places. For you to continue to do business here, we must see who you voted for. We must see it, yo. We must see it. And when you are voting, you have your, you have your phone. You can snap your, 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 uh, the party you voted for. It is secret ballot. You collect your, you do your, your by modem, you take your card, you vote. When you vote, snap what you wear, you vote for that party. If you did not see this there, you are in trouble. We will fight. Tell your daughter to snap it for you. Yes. I don't know, but what we are saying, we are not, this is not a trend. Let me tell you, it's not a trend, so we are telling you the facts. If you think, if you, think you want to do it on your own, on your own way, do it. We are not agreeing with you. It's not a trend. Wherever you are doing your business, 
you are able to feed your family, your wife, and send your children to school, whatever they do in that place, you have to do it. Because if those people did not accommodate, you won't be able to stay there and be doing your business. And that's what we are telling you. If you want to continue to do your business here and do it peacefully and honestly and take the gains to your states, do what you want to do. Do what we have asked you to do. Go to the party that we have been going. Or like before, we do go and beg. Please, please, please. We are not begging this time around. We are not begging. Now. What we are saying is just the fact. It's just the fact. Except, except you feel that you are okay with whatever you have done in fact. And you are going to another place. You all know how far it is. As one, as one person is living by and 10 people are coming. Maybe so. If one person lives by and today, 20 people must go come to Bara. It's not by how many It's God. I got a job. I got a job. I got a job. I mean, I don't feel good for you. I don't feel good for you. Lagos, I feel So, whatever we are doing in Lagos State, let us do it together so that everybody will continue to live very peacefully and happily. Thank you very much. So, 